What's up you guys, my name is Quincy Gardner and today I want to do a video about uh, the GH4 uh, settings that I use. I got a question from my friend Cameron, I uh, recently moved to New York and uh, he bought a GH4. So uh, I wanted to talk about the, the two settings. Uh, the first is the Cine D and uh, the second is the Supertone. The Supertone is essentially uh, the portrait picture style and suggested uh, to get good looking skin tones and the least amount of noise. So the very first shot is actually uh, the Cine D profile. Um, as you can see, it's really flat. It gives you a nice flat look. So I like Cine style, and um, it also can match uh, the uh, log footage um, if adjusted. Uh, if adjusted uh, somewhat more to get even flatter, so you can match cameras. Uh, this next shot is actually um, super tones. Uh, as you can see, it looks the colors look baked in. Uh, looks really saturated. Um, but you can adjust it, and I found that it has the least amount of noise in the shots. You can get up to 1600, which I have, and uh, you can still get a nice, uh, crisp uh, image with this. Um, so, you know, both of them have their ups and downs. Uh, so, as you can see, it's a comparison. Uh, I'd say um, do not use the Super Tone if you want to use LUTs. Um, Noam Kroll, you guys can check him out. He's, uh, he's done the comparison, and uh, it looks terrible using the Super Tones. But um, my first work that I, I use the Super Tones with exclusively is uh, weddings. You know, I have a wedding business, so in all my weddings, in this wedding right here, I was using uh, 1600 ISO, 800 to 1600 ISO. Uh, I had no control over the lighting, and so uh, actually all of the footage came out great, least amount of noise. Uh, another wedding, uh, both using Super Tone setting, and um, we were able to have a quick turnaround and not really focus on uh, color grading uh, the weddings not saying that I don't but we were really in a rush and so Supertones uh, made it to where as we could get the uh, the best looking image uh, as possible but uh, there's the pros to Cine D um, with all narrative work I would absolutely use Cine D never Supertones uh, as you can see uh, you can uh, do a lot you can use LUTs you can color grade it uh, and, and pretty much just get a lot of looks so it's I'd say if you want to do professional uh, film work, I would say uh, use Cine D. Um, but they both have they both have their pros and cons. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and got to check to get got to take a look at the settings that I use in camera. Uh, anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will do more and uh, in the future. So uh, thank you for subscribing and uh, until next time, I'll talk to you guys later.